good. <laughs> um, I think it's very like nerve wracking. I don't think a lot of people put uh, like emphasis on like how much people value like their pets and stuff like that. And like, you know, like I have Dex registered as like an emotional support dog. So, you know, it was a very big deal for me. Like I definitely was like, hold everything. Like I gotta go find my dog. So yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, uh, the same thing I've been saying all season, uh, it's more so just me being a professional and being locked in, regardless of my minutes. That's something that I definitely want to be known and something that I take a lot of pride in just coming in every day and just trying to get better. Uh, we get paid to do a job and to show up. And regardless of how many minutes you get when coach calls your number, like that you need to be ready. So I really try to just take pride in that this year and just be ready when my opportunity is called. And like, even if I'm not playing, just focus on keep on trying to get better. Um, I mean, I believe in myself a lot and I feel like that I, as long as I keep on getting better and I keep the right mindset and I keep working hard that I, the sky is the limit. So I just try to keep my head down, keep on working. And when coach Brooks calls my name, I just try to be a professional and go out there and do what the team needs, especially because sitting on the bench, you get to see like kind of like what we're missing a little bit. So I just tried to be that spark today. No, not at all. It's more so of just being ready when your name is called, you know, and that's the side of being a professional. You know, you get paid to come in and do your job and to try to, you know, help the team. And that's your role. Like Coach said after the game today, he was like, we need all 15 guys to be ready. As you know, I guess. So I just try to take pride in that. And I think you have. Uh, for me personally, I was just locked in on defense. I was just locked in on trying to do little things. Uh, that's the biggest thing for me at the end of the day. I know Brad and Russ can score the basketball and facilitate and make plays. And that's the biggest thing is like right now we just need guys to fill their roles and kind of like just do the little things on the court and just like play as hard as they can. You know, at the end of the day, we're a very talented group and I'm surrounded by a whole bunch of great players that are really good and really talented. So it's just more so of trying to figure out what we need and then going and executing that as as hard as I can and just give 110 when I'm out there. I feel like for me personally, like at the end of the day, it's just one of those things where I show up and I just try to be more about the action than I am about the talking. Uh, that's just me though. Like that's how I am. I feel like a lot of the guys in the organization kind of know that. Like I just take pride in showing up and being locked in and just you know, like I said, just trying to make the most of my opportunity. There's only 450 guys in the league, you know. Like, I'm still blessed to be here and blessed to have the opportunity that I have. So I'm just trying to keep that mentality and just keep on trying to get better every day, so.